18 months ago, Governor Kate Brown selected Oregon's first public records advocate. Yesterday, she abruptly resigned. So, how did we get here? To answer that, we have to go back to Friday, February 13th, 2015, and another resignation. Former Governor John Kitzhabers, after an ongoing influence-peddling controversy involving his then fiance Sylvia Hayes. Brown, who was next in line as Secretary of State, became the governor. Then just four months later, she passed three ethics reform bills, calling on an audit of how state agencies handle public records in the wake of the Kitzhaber controversy. And five months after that, the audit found rampant failures on the part of state agencies to track and respond to public records requests. Now, the state feared the lack of transparency could threaten their credibility. So on January 4th, 2018, Governor Brown named former Department of Labor attorney Ginger McCall to be Oregon's first public records advocate. Her role was to mediate disputes between the public and state and local governments over which records should be released or kept confidential. And that brings us to yesterday, September 9th, 2019, when McCall abruptly resigned. She accused members of the government's legal staff of pressuring her to take the governor's side on matters of public records. Governor Brown said she was surprised to hear that and wished McCall had come to her earlier with her concerns. She also threw her own legal staff under the bus, saying it appeared they were conflicted between the goals of serving the governor and promoting the cause of transparency. And that's how we got here.